know that you have three electrons in the uh, set of orbitals that are stabilized in an octahedral uh, crystal field. Then we can consider something else that's called CFSE. And I think, I think I should have, nope, I don't have that on there. Okay, so I'll write that out. So this is the crystal field stabilization energy. So it's not the crystal field splitting energy, it's the stabilization energy, which indicates how much those electrons are stabilized by being in an octahedral field rather than this hypothetical uh, spherical crystal field. And so what we can do there is you see that you have three electrons in those lower sets of orbitals, and those orbitals are stabilized by two fifths times the octahedral crystal field splitting energy. And so that gives an answer of minus six fifths times the octahedral crystal field splitting energy. So that's how much those electrons are stabilized. So they are lower in energy. See, the average energy is much, much higher in this hypothetical case. But because of uh, having this octahedral geometry, and there are only three electrons to uh, consider, they all go into the stabilized uh, energy. And so they're stabilized by minus 6 fifths times whatever the octahedral crystal field splitting energy is for uh, this particular case. So now let's look at another example. So let's